Hey, today I just want to say a few words, a few words about Alzheimer's disease. So my mother, um, back in 1979, uh, was uh, started to show first signs and symptoms of, well, I wouldn't say first, but we started to notice uh, signs and symptoms of Alzheimer's disease. She was 49 years old and I was 19 years old. Uh, back during that time, uh, that was devastating. A lot of people had never heard of Alzheimer's. It certainly wasn't uh, like today where uh, everybody knows somebody or has somebody in their family or in their friend pool that um, has Alzheimer's disease. And I would say we have an epidemic of Alzheimer's disease. I want to uh, tell you that I have personally been preventing Alzheimer's disease in myself for the last 20 years. There is so much science that supports uh, that tells us what's going on. How does Alzheimer's disease begin in the first place? Um, what are the causative factors? What are the things that are going on? What kind of processes happen in the brain that uh, make these changes that make Alzheimer's disease take hold? And I want to tell you science going back decades and accumulating and accumulating with time, tons of science tells us what's going on and also tells us what we can do to prevent and even in some cases uh, stop progression. And I would uh, I would put out there even uh, reverse if you're talking about um, the uh, reversal in the cognitive symptoms that that you're seeing in a particular person. So uh, that might sound like pie in the sky, but I know what I'm talking about. And I just did uh, first in about a three-part series. It depends on how long it gets as I continue um, working it up, outsmarting Alzheimer's. And uh, you can find this on my website, uh, the first one. It is, uh, you, you need to take advantage of this because this information is like gold. If I had known what I know now, if I was, when I was a young adult dealing with my mother, my mother, uh, lived with my husband and I during her, her time with Alzheimer's disease. I changed her diapers, um, you know, the whole nine yards. She died in my arms, a very old woman at the ripe old age of 58. If someone had given me this insight, then it would have changed our lives. I think about um, the movie Back to the Future with my, Michael J. Fox. And I think if I knew what I know now, and could go back with that information to myself at uh, in my early 20s, uh, as my mother is succumbing to this dreadful disease, um, it would have changed everything. So uh, pay attention. You, you're, you're not going to find this out. Um, through your doctor. You're not going to find these things out uh, through the um, Alzheimer's Association. You're not going to find out uh, these things anyway, unless you do the homework and learn from someone who, you know, like me, who's revealing this stuff. I mean, you can find it out yourself, but it's kind of easier if somebody does that um, legwork first and then just presents it to you. Um, I have no, uh, I have no uh, motive in doing this except to get the word out there. We have so much more power than we know when it comes to our health. And the good thing is the things that work to offset the, um, the deteriorating processes of Alzheimer's disease are also factors in many other degenerative diseases. So while you're preventing your Alzheimer's disease, you're also preventing cancer. You're also preventing Parkinson's disease. You're also preventing um, just the normal um, degenerative processes. You're slowing down those normal de degenerative processes of aging. It's huge. It's huge. And uh, you, the word needs to get out. So I hope you will take advantage of these materials. Keep coming back. If you're watching on Rumble or YouTube uh, and you're not familiar with me or my work, go to wondersuits.org uh, and then go to research files, drop down to Alzheimer's disease, which is right there up at the top because of the A uh, alphabetically. And um, I will be posting more and more things, but you can see that uh, first video right now, one hour long outsmarting Alzheimer's um, so anyway, stay tuned, be well, you have so much more power than you know, and you need to know uh, what to do to take care of control of your own health and the health of those you um, love. Take care and have a wonderful day.